the Emancipation Proclamation was issued by our 16th President, Abraham Lincoln. The executive order freed slaves in the South and added a powerful ally to the Union war effort. This is the Emancipation Proclamation in plain English by Josh, Evan, and Adam. Lincoln never meant for the Civil War to abolish slavery. He wanted to keep the Union together and bring the South back into the country. But during the war, Lincoln saw opportunity to help, to help the Union win the war. And that would soon be the Emancipation Proclamation. He saw that he could free slaves in the South and that he could recruit slaves to help join the army. The preliminary Emancipation Proclamation was issued on September 22, 1862, which warned the southern states that in a hundred days, if they did not lay down their guns and join the Union, on January 1, 1863, he would free the slaves in the southern states. The Emancipation First for this to happen, Congress passed two important laws, these being the Militia Act of 1862, which allowed African Americans to join the Army. Second is the Second Confiscation Act, which allowed the president to end slavery in the southern states. On January 1st, 1863, the rebellion states had ceased to come back to the Union. So President Abraham Lincoln issued the final Emancipation Proclamation. It was a necessary thing to preserve the Union in accomplishing the paramount objective of the war. Lincoln has secure secured liberty in 10 rebellion states, but the five southern states that accepted Lincoln as president still had slaves because Lincoln did not have the power to abolish slavery. The Emancipation Proclamation added a powerful ally to the Union war effort. This regional conflict became a war for slavery as many Ameri African American slaves contributed to the war searching for that precious gift of liberty.